What is up, everyone? My goodness gracious. Look how many people are here. <laughs> BZ Hub Mom is here. Hello, BZ Hub Mom. My God, there's so many people. That's crazy. This is awesome. It's going to be hard. It's getting harder and harder to read off everyone's names. Jack Brellin, then Caden Carpenter, Mr. Gamer Guy YouTube, Among Us Moments, Tristan Jack, Bryce Bendick is here, Harrison Go, Cat is here, Louise, James, Arapaima, Grant King is here, Rilly Lop, Lee Lop, goodness gracious, Cantor is here, uh, uh, Cooler Cactus is here. I'm like trying to pick out names, real cringeless. And of course, BZ Hub Mom is here. Excellent. Thank you so much, Llama64. Of course, I remember you. Real Hunter09, I remember you, of course. Alex Mankis is here. Van D, G Man, JJ. Golly. Megan's here. How's Megan? Jamie Pia Thompson. Jamie's here. Good deal. Good deal, everyone. Well, I know this is a big deal, uh, and, the, and the video hasn't even come out yet. So uh, yeah, we're at October River, and we're catching some really big fish. If you saw the, uh, yeah, if you if you saw the darn uh, uh, thumbnail, there are some monster fish here. So uh, yeah. It's gonna be it's gonna be a lot of fun, everyone. Um, it is nighttime right now, but we're about to change it today. Do do do. Hendry Gravelar is here. How's it going, Hendry Gravelar? I'm giving you all a uh, a taste of tomorrow's video. By the way, it's gonna be the uh, the Christmas the Christmas lo-fi everyone it's pretty it is pretty fun it's nice music to listen to when you're just trying to relax do some studying do some reading something like that it's got a little beat to it but it's relaxing you know what is this about hey you <laughs> Alex, thank you so much. Goodness gracious, starting it off with a bang. With a bang, Alex says. Tell you what, we're going to go straight into... Oh, let's do... Uh, let's do 8 a.m. Straight into 8 a.m., everyone. Straight out of 8 a.m. That's what we're doing here. Okay, so I was having a lot of luck right here. Um, I had some luck down by the bridge, but the majority of my luck was right here. So this is where we're gonna start. Um, I was catching fish on lures, but I was also catching a lot of them on duck muscle meat. So that's what we're gonna try. <laughs> we're gonna throw out duck muscle meat and hope for the best. It was awesome. Tristan Jack, thanks, man. Appreciate it. Glad you enjoyed it. As always, goodness gracious. Love, I love when people are enjoying the content. Uh, we, uh, we don't have any duck muscle meat on this one. There we go. Now we're good. Um, yeah, I might have to switch it up a little bit. Uh, you'll find out in the video, but I was catching a lot more of one fish than the one I was trying to catch. So uh, we might have to change some stuff up if that continues. Jack Bolstridge is here. How's it going? Sports Tuber. Hello, hello. Louise James buying my first Pelagon on the weekend. Hey, right on, man. I remember buying my first Pelagon. My dad and I took it out. We shot, I don't even remember what we shot. A bunch of cans, I think, that day. I remember it. When the new map for Call of the Wild, will you do live stream the day it comes out? Oh, maybe. Maybe, maybe. You're the first like on the stream. Well, thanks, Caden Carpenter. Yeah, I mean, if it, if everyone hasn't hasn't hit that like button yet, you know, it's it's free. I won't charge you for it. Hit, hit the like button. It, that'd be great. But yeah, let's see if we can uh, pull out something. Oop, I'm using the wrong one. I have my nighttime stuff equipped still. Let's equip on this medium spoon. My first day here was insane. Uh, so I'm hoping that this second day is is just even a fraction of that would be great we will see any tips for the first tournament uh 
Man, just get through it. You're, you're going to lose your first tournament. I'm just being honest. Uh, tournaments in the fishing fishing plan are difficult. They really are. Uh, so just get a taste for it. Realize that you're most likely going to lose. Um, you know, I have seen people win uh, some of the beginner ones, like one at Lone Star Lake. Got some beeping going on over here. Love the new vid. Just got done watching. Hey, right on, man. Fids, you have always been my favorite streamer, Lana64. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Glad that you're here. Hey, look at that. We got us a fish. Ooh, ooh. I don't know what that is, but uh, man, oh my, it's coming right ass. <laughs> the the drag went way up real quick. I think it's a. Oh, if I had to guess, I'm guessing a Xander. But maybe it's an asp. Those asps. I'm telling you, nice little six pound asp. They're pretty fish, honestly. The model for the asp is really, really nice. So that's awesome. You just wait till you watch the video. You'll see my first asp I caught. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Just uh, tips first go meet, catch them all. Ooh, I'm telling you the beeping, the beeping here. Fish plant, let's go. That's a lot of videos. I was surprised looking at my thumbnails. You know, I always forget how many videos I've put out. But yeah, when I was like putting, I always save my thumbnails, you know, Fishing Planet 26, Fishing Planet 27. And, and when I like looked at the number on that, like uh, the other day we hit the live stream of 50 and I was like, wow, we've had 50 live streams. That's crazy. Um, but yeah, seeing that we have seeing remembering how long it takes me to make a fishing planet beginner series video and then realizing that i have over 20 of them i was like oh my gosh it's crazy <laughs> it's only 8 40 cat's exhausted well what are you gonna do cat what are you, you just gonna relax so i can donate to don't worry about it llama 64 i just appreciate you being here that's that's what matters to me look at this got another one oof it's got some fight it's got some fight it's 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 uh it's putting up a little tussle for its right to party i believe i'm finally going to try and get my hunting license over the weekend we'll ride on go get it so this asp is actually a uh is in the carp family look at that nice little trophy asp you really have to make sure you put that p on the end otherwise you just sound like a cringy person i'd like a a big ol' asp today. Asp p -p 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 -p. Right at the end there. Good deal. Nice asp. That's great. 1,500. That's awesome. Let's uh, throw out again. Catch another one. Bo, what should you fish for? I don't know, Vandy. Where are you? I don't even know what you can fish for. I'm learning how to butterfly knife, which is fun. Also, good luck. Connor Struther, thank you so much. Go and try to, anyway. Bryce, I'm going, getting a present for Christmas. I wonder what it is. Ooh. Ooh, I have some ideas, though I'm not sure what side of the road you're on if you catch my drift. I really needed a nap today. Smash the Trash. Did you get a nap today, Smash the Trash? Has the newest update come out on console yet? I don't know. Do they have a Christmas event for fishing or planet? Haven't played in a minute. Yes, they do, I believe. Though I haven't been able to do it yet, so it must be coming out uh, later on. Jason Whitten, how's it going, Jason? First day of work tomorrow, one month locked on UK, still stayed. I'm still awake to watch you. <laughs> Alex. Well, thank you, Alex. Feel free to go to bed, though. You won't hurt my feelings. Sounds like you need it. First day at work. My goodness. Dakota James Zalman. Hello, hello. And smash the trash. My goodness. Lockdown improved the numbers of those being dying. I bet you are excited to go back. Yeah, well, I've heard mixed mixed uh, things in the UK from one of my old professors in college. Squish Flint is here. Squish is here. Have no fear. The squish is here. You did not get a nap today. Gosh darn. No luck on these darn uh, these darn bottom rods at the moment. But you know what? It's right about that time you think, okay, I better reel these in and throw them out again. 
that's when something ends up happening. So we'll just, you know, we'll stay patient. I'll give it another five minutes. We don't get a bite in five minutes. We'll, we'll, we'll reel them in and throw them back out. Llama 64 is Canadian. I really love hunting games. It's like you can handle you 13 to hunt and you're only nine. Ah, I see. Okay. I understand. Oh, there's some beeping. Stop and go is working for us. Goodness gracious, a little more frequent beeping now. You're in Rocky Lake, ooh, okay. You know, I enjoyed, uh, I, I mean, honestly, any trout there is fun. Uh, I would throw out minnows on a feeder rod and catch rainbow trout there. That was a lot of fun. Um, so I don't know. That's that's Rocky Lake for me, anyway. That's what I would do at Rocky Lake. If you're gonna go for carp, though. Yeah, go go for it. You can go to uh, the starting area or uh, the European starting area where it has small carp. That would be fun for sure. What are they? Always the air was free until I bought a bag of chips. <gasps> oh my goodness. I'll stay for a bit to watch. Right on, Jack. Understandable. With Fishing Planet and the Hunter Call of the Wild, it seems that the updates always come out on PC before they do on console. Well, you know, I don't know if you know this, but they actually design the uh, the, the gameplay stuff using computers. And so, uh, you know, that and they have... <laughs> that really doesn't have anything to do with it. But they do have, they ha they do have more experience working with computers. Not only that, um, but... You know, Steam uh, allows for updates uh, as much as you know you want to, because Steam only updates uh, certain games at a time and everything. So honestly, they just kind of allow developers to do whatever they want whenever they want. Versus Sony and Microsoft, they like create a bottleneck. You have to go through Sony and Microsoft's upload days, and so, so yeah. It seemed like for some reason they must have missed a deadline and the next upload day for Sony and Microsoft was going to be in early 2021. And uh, yeah, and they would rather just get it out on PC now because why wait, you know, make everyone wait. I think if anything, if they were going to attack it in any way, uh, they should put out the beta uh, and December 10th like they want and then uh, and then they could put out the full release later on or something like that that way they could get some testing in but even then like with the testing being done in the beta I the thing is is that they already they already are going to try and hit the upload for 2021 but if there's anything they need to change then it'll have to wait till the next upload after the games already come out so when you know when there was issues with the missions on consoles and they were like, I can't, I can't believe you, you didn't know this, you know, it should have been ready for us or something like that. Well, it's like they didn't have all the testing going on. Uh, and so they missed their upload and then they had to wait for the next upload. And then it just, it was a whole kerfluffle. You all know that. Colt Faze is here. I'm just ranting at the moment. Rodney A's harvesting whitetail. Good, good going. Pierce Van Fleet. Aha! TH Kilo is here. How's it going, Kilo? I saw that, Tristan Jack. That's awesome. Bryce, I'm thinking. I was thinking some sort of console, man. That's what. That's what I'm thinking anyway. Play Phasmophobia if he's getting scared by werewolves the hunter that I can't even imagine what Phasmophobia would be like. You know, I've seen some of that, Jack. Uh, but, uh, I tried to get my brother and King Liam to play it, and they wouldn't play it with me, so... It was going to be in the cards, though. We were all going to play it, the three of us. And, uh, and then everyone just kind of dropped out, so, whatever. Looking spicy, how's you been, Levi? Been doing well, man. I was hoping everyone would like the uh, the holiday-ish 
designs and whatnot, so that's good. I'm glad you noticed. I, not too many people tell me that they like it, so that's, that's good. I appreciate it. Haven't watched your vids in a while, Jack Powell. Well, where you been, man? You been, have you been uh, on a trip somewhere without internet? What's going on? What's going on, man? Got your flu shot today, right on Dakota. Deadshot420, how's it going? You have any tips on the rock meat right now? I'm using Creek Pro 710 and I'm using pet food and I just can't get one fish. Uh, if you can buy small minnows, try that, Llama64. I had good uh, good um, luck with the minnows. It's a pyramid. Duh. Don't you know it's oblate? It's an oblate. Thank you. Karsten the Fly Fisherman is here, right on. I know, cat. You know, if you can top if you can talk Flinter into collabing with me, I would say yes in a heartbeat. But I don't want to bother him. Coral D, thank you so much. Love you. Love you all. <laughs> Kai Lenore. Kai Lenore is here. Hi, Kai. I'm usually a fishing plant person, but I'm going to play Call of the Wild now. So bye. Okay. Well, bye, sports tuber. I tell you what. I said I was going to reel these in. I'm going to have to. I thought we were going to have a fish there for a second. They were beeping like crazy. But then they didn't They didn't get anything. So uh, we'll... we'll uh, We'll reel these in and throw them back out. Do you have the walker, BZ? I don't have a walker with me. I can see if they have one in the store. Oh, there's some beeping. I just like to mix it up sometimes. Just reel it in and throw it back out there. You don't want things to get too stale, you know? Keep the fish on their toes, on the on the on their, their tails. You should make a pet channel and get fish. Don't have to, though. Make a pet channel and get fish. Yeah? Like a YouTube channel for fish or something? Like, what, what are we talking about? <laughs> Throw this one out here. I'm gonna go fish for carp. Right on, Vandy. Go get him. Uh, I do not, Connor Struther. That, that is all you, man. Coral needs to be chill. <laughs> it must have gotten excited about something. Oh, goodness. How's the fishing today? You know, earlier today it was really good. And we should be having some really good fishing, but uh, it's a little slow at the moment. Well, 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 oh, that was, that was unexpected. That's not what I want. Ooh, ooh, there's some beeping. Take it! There you Ooh, not very big. Guessing like a 10 pound wells, maybe. If that. M1X operation! Notice you. I am noticing you. Austin Kitching, he plays on PS4, right on. Here we go, little wells. Our first little wells of the day. 11 pounds, one pound more than what I was thinking anyway. <laughs> Very nice. Got our first little wells catfish there. We'll keep him. I like the music, it's great vibes. Oh, thanks. I hope it doesn't get annoying. We're gonna have a few more days of this being the holiday season and whatnot. I'll try to mix up the music though. Whoa. Whoa. I think a fish tried to go for it at the end there. You wait until you watch the video. I had something crazy happen in like this last like five feet here. That was insane. There there are so many crazy things that happen in this video coming out next week. So I'm I'm just excited. How is everyone today? My older 33 platinum reel got gummed up, so I'm asking a new one for my that's a perfect that's a perfect birthday gift. Cold phase, good idea. I thought you were going to do some carp fishing. 
Man, I tell you what, when we unlock Weeping Willows, you better strap your seat to your self because we're going to be doing a lot of carb fishing. So get ready for that. Until then, we're trying to catch a Big Wells catfish and uh, and something, anything else, basically. Honestly, we're just we're just fishing. We're just trying to catch fish. Oh my god. I would then start raising money to remove the BZ Hub logo from your forehead, Megan. <laughs> Took a hit to the bank account today, bought the Orvis Helios 3D fly rod, 900. Wow, my goodness gracious, Carson. I hope that that sounds awesome, though. Should be great. Raza, you as well. Thank you so much. Where do you catch Channel Cat at Lone Star? You know, I just kind of aim for the deep spots of the lake. But I'm sure there's a better place. I've just never been great at it. Logan Viral just got back from mudding. Mudding around. M mudding around. Three call the wild. Well, fantastic, Canter. Keep at it. On level two speed. Yeah, you've got it, Alex Super Stoopy. <laughs> Did you catch a carp yet? Not this time around, though I guess the asp is kind of in the carp family, according to the description, so kind of we did, in a way. Naro, sorry I'm being late going through some... Hey, Godzilla, you are fine, my friend. Do what you can. Anxiety and pressure this month is always hard for me. Oh, no! Well, hopefully it's better with, you know, some family here. You know? BZ Hub family. Do I like bow hunting and Hunter Call of the Wild? You know what? I, I don't have anything against it. I used to love the recurve in the Hunter Call of the Wild. Then they made it like the longbow as far as aiming goes and drop and everything like that. And I can't stand it. So it, they like ruined my favorite bow in that game. <laughs> um, but yeah. Eh. Other than that, uh, I'm usually, I don't have enough uh, patience to hunt with a bow. But, uh, you know, it's not that bad. Got the fire, BZ. Special cut. Special cut. Thanks, bro. Got haircut today. Trying to look fly. Doing my part. Taking it. Take it. Oh, that was such a good nibble, though. You wanted it. I could tell. Hey, right on. Go for it, G-Man. Got a five-pound bass. Right on, Llama. You're always a move. Joshua Gallahan, how's it going? Mr. Krabs like money. Money. Ah, oh, you pain. You're being a pain. I was just trying to freaking reel into the right. Can't wait to play at Austin Kitchen. Yeah, right on, man. For a free game, it's it's great. I love how slow the progression is. It makes me feel good about everything I do in this game. <laughs> 200 apple seeds at a time. Wow. You know, you know that Roger Cruz. It's it is interesting you bring that up because uh, I was chewing on 198 apple seeds one time, and I like passed out and I had no idea why. Doctors said, yeah, if you would have had two more in there, you would have died immediately. And I was like, <gasps> that's crazy because I had two apple seeds in my hand ready to go, but I passed out before I could do it. So, so don't do it. Don't do it. Do you play NASCAR games? I don't play NASCAR games. Never been into NASCAR, be honest. <laughs> but that's okay. Some people are, you know. Since because of football and stuff, last time I spent six hours with nothing and then a tiny roach takes number one hook, I was fuming. 
Hey, that sounds great. You caught a fish. Saw you live and I got so happy. Right on, Godzilla. Coral D is going to catch a uh, carp with his brother Vandy. Well, right on. That's awesome. A hundred times better. <laughs> Good. Spearfish and the hunter, you technically shotting a spear. I mean, uh, yeah, I guess. Whatever makes people happy, I suppose. Oh, Bryce is gonna be back later, okay. With the bow now, because of the high-tech pack, the scope and the stuff is too much fun. Too much fun. I got you. Austin Gaming is here, how's it going? I love you like a dad, bro. Love you like a dad. You have no idea. Okay, this spot is not working. This spot is not working. We're learning things today, everyone. We were doing much better on a cloudy day. Now it's sunny out, and I guess it's just not... It's not good. Tell you where we might be able to get stuff with the sun, though. Let's go try some carp. Might be able to get a pretty decent-sized carp. We'll go check out the carp, anyway. You wish DLC weren't a thing. What? Well, you're making videos now, Canter. You'll learn that DLCs are like the best thing in the world. You get new content. New, new stuff to make videos about. You better get into the creator mindset, man. 200,000 of carp. 200,000 of carp. 200,000 of carp. Well, it looks like a good carp spot. I'm looking. I'm not seeing any activity. It is like dead out here. This is insane. It's like everything we're wanting to fish for is just gone today. Liam Cone Fishing! Thanks, Liam! Tell you what we can do. This is gonna be expensive. I don't know why we're doing this. <laughs> okay. Um. actually leaving and we're gonna come back it's gonna cost me eleven thousand dollars to do this so i hope i hope you all enjoy it <laughs> i just hope we catch more fish it was crazy i was catching so many fish and then we get into the stream and we're like catching nothing so uh hopefully that changes here we go oh dang i should have bought more minnows before we got it oh well oh well do you like Hollow Live? I don't know what Hollow Live is. Hall Olive? Is it Hall Olive? That almost sounds like a thing. Liam Cone Fishing loves the vids. Hey, thank you. Millbrook Meatheads is here. Well, thank you for the subscribe, Liam. Plays just subscribed. Thanks, Plays. Appreciate it. All right, let's throw this back out here. It's a cloudy day now, you see? That's the difference. That's the difference. The difference, whoop. Jim Bob is here. How's it going, Jim? What is the best fishing spot on Rocky Lake? I like fishing on the far right side. M1X operation. Thank you so much, man. Thanks for the subscribe. Do you play the Call of the Wild much anymore? Yeah. Yeah, we do. We play it every Monday and Thursday. Um, and then we put out some beginner series videos every once in a while. We do news over it as well. Um, I don't like to put out every single diamond video. I've got, I have, you have no idea. I've got so many diamond videos. Just like I have recordings of shooting diamonds. 
just like laying around and I just don't do anything about it because I just feel like uh, making diamond videos are such cop-outs. They're so easy to do. Nathan Sheffer! Is it Sheffer or Sheffer? I want to make sure I'm saying it right. But I mean, if people want to watch diamond videos, I'll start making them, I guess. So that's what you want to watch. I don't know. <laughs> Miss what I said earlier, you don't know how, how to count because that's not three spin and then one second pause. Oh, yeah. Well, I don't take people's advice. I just do my own thing, you know? But I appreciate you you sharing. <laughs> Going good, man. How about you? I'm going well. I'm 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 going well as well. I'm going well as well. Oh, we're doing good. So we got lots of nibbles right now. We just need to just gotta wait for that take, bruh. Can you do an episode for the best ways to earn money for low-level people, please? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I could. Just like a big summary, basically. Ooh, that's a lot of nibbles. Take it. That's going. That's going. It seemed like it was going to be heavy for a little bit. I was thinking to myself, eh, it's got a little bit of weight to it. I'm guessing this is a Wells Catfish in the teens. Somewhere in the teens. I can tell by the way the numbers are getting reeled in. It's a little slow, but not a lot. Oh, it's actually a 30 pounder. Good God. Well, you just gave up, man. <laughs> what are you doing? You silly catfish. A little 30 pound wells. Not bad at all. Keep that guy. Throw this back out. We got more to catch. More to catch. Ethan! What did Ethan say? I couldn't even see. Ethan Raymer! There. Shouted you out. I don't understand shout outs. I don't. Why do you want me to scream your name? <laughs> I say, if you show up at the beginning of the stream, I say everyone's name. So I'm pretty much giving everyone a shout out. I shout out everyone's name. Another Wells here. Little guy. Oh, I had to think about it. 11 pounds there. Whoa, Brian Household, that is something else there, man. <laughs> I love when you go live. Well, thanks, Coral D. Alexander Squilini. It does sound familiar, you crazy. You do such a good job on it. It's so good. Hey, thanks, Austin. Appreciate it. Getting by to my bar, but the current is moving, so I'm done. <laughs> you know, I sometimes get tricked by the, the currents as well. Dad's gone out to get Sunday, so tonight's gonna be good. Man, that brings back memories. I remember my dad bringing us like peanut butter parfaits from Dairy Queen. Um, mm -mm, mm -mm. That's what I'm talking about. Wells catfish have the weirdest looking tail, it's true. It's, they're cool though. I remember reading about them in like books. I used to like just read like fish books and, and random stuff like that in, in elementary school. And I remember seeing pictures of the Wells catfish and I was just like, ooh, ooh. I say read, I, I mostly just looked at pictures. I just, I just wanted to see the fish. <laughs> you say that every time and then you do it every time. I, STG, just don't do the shout outs. You weenie. <laughs> because you have the perfect voice. That's so not true. How could that be true? I'm 
already loving it. Hey, right on. I mean, that Bass Boat Explorer pack is pretty cool. That Bass Boat going fast and whatnot. It's pretty sweet. What bait do you use for Channel Cat? Oh, you can use so much stuff. Cheese, dog food, worms. Though the worms will get caught up by a lot of different stuff. It's basically just trying to figure out what what food they eat that other fish don't eat. So that way you can kind of single out the channel cat. But uh, yeah. Oh yeah, you remember the parfaits, of course. Yeah, those are the days, mom, I'm telling you. Oh, here we go, here we got a fish. Ooh, ooh. That one's got some weight to it. That's what I like to see. See, this is the moment I'm, I'm thinking to myself. Could be a big Wells, but uh, we'll all see here in a second. I'm, I'm 50. I'll be very excited if it's actually a Wells. In my experience, though, it's, it's not a Wells. So this will be a very exciting... Come here and surface, you silly goose. Couldn't have gone on my heavier rod, huh? Have you ever tried fly fishing for bass or other fish? You know, my brother and I went out the other day and tried fly fishing just for some bluegill. And, uh, and we could not get any of them out of there. I'm not sure what the deal was. Maybe they've moved on for the winter to somewhere else or something, but uh, we just did not have any luck. Look at that. The stress on that line is just at the top. Comrade Doge, how's it going? You gotta go, hey, thanks, Llama. Oh, 34. Might be a diamond. Here's the thing, it hasn't surfaced this whole time. So now I'm starting to lean towards the wells. If so, this is gonna be a, a, a PB for sure because my biggest well so far is a trophy. And this is fighting more than that. Oh golly. Here we go, it's coming towards us now. Hey you, stop beeping. I'm gonna try to get away from the beeping. Ooh, ooh. It could be, it, it, it honestly could be. I saw what could have been a tail come up out of the water. It's going out to 70 now. I think it, I think it honestly might be. Yeah. I think we're looking at an unicorn. A unicorn pigeon eater. Ethan Raber, biggest fish you ever caught in this game. I caught today, 120 pounds. Just a pound more than my tarpon that I caught when we were trying out the Bass Boat Explorer pack. You think so, Raza? Here's the thing. My experience in catching those, Raza, they surface a lot. They come up out of the water a lot. Hey, there we go. And, and this whole time, it only surfaced like twice, which was very surprising. But yeah, you're right, it is. I was really hoping that it wouldn't be, but uh, gosh darn. So no, no unicorns, just a big fish. Gosh darn it. Another big fish. Ugh, that's, the, that's terrible. Are crickets good? Crickets are good for the right fish. I mean, every bait's pretty good for the right fish. Come here, 44 now. We're sub 40. Sub 40. Ooh, looks like a shark.
Look at that. Get over here, man. My favorite thing about belugas is that they just kind of... They just kind of lumber around wherever they want to go. They just kind of really give me as kind of like an Eeyore type fish. Just kind of... Well, I guess I'll go over here. And it's like when it turns away to swim away from you, it just does it so effortlessly. Just swims away. Look at it. <laughs> Come here, you. Oof, look at this nose. <laughs> that is a giant fish. 102 pounds there, 2,200 experience. That's the one thing about these belugas is that they give you a ton of experience. That is a beluga right there. My goodness gracious. Heenil, obviously. No trouble at all. 102 pounds? <laughs> Nothing. Psst. Our babies on our planets weigh more than this. You know, no big deal. He's basically a superman among men. Hey, right on, right on. That's awesome. First beluga of the stream. Let's uh, let's keep it going. That's all. We can't keep them. Even with the advanced license, you can't keep them. So, good experience, though. Let's throw out. We have to fix our other rod as well. How do I catch bigger fish when I just started playing? When you just start playing, uh, just think of it as uh, improving the hook size. If you want to catch a bigger fish, put on a bigger hook. As you add, as you change to larger hooks, the percentage of fish that you can catch slowly gets smaller. You know, you could catch, um, think of it as like in a day's fishing, you might be able to catch 60, uh, four pound largemouth bass or something like that. Two to four pounds. Uh, you could catch 60 of them. But if you go up to the, the largest hook size so that you can really narrow it down to only catching the the 8 to, to 12 pounders, then you might only catch 6 bass per day. Or you might catch 12 bass a day. Um, that's that's the main difference. As you go up in hook size, you're, you're getting rid of the smaller fish um, to target the bigger fish. And so you're, you're going to catch less fish, but you're also going to catch larger fish. So that's that's kind of the biggest thing for a fishing planet. Yes, absolutely, Connor. Xbox boy, six George, love your boy. Oh, thanks, Xbox boy. Ethan Raber, my biggest tip is honestly just watch the beginner series. I struggled the same way. Try and copy me, go to the different different places, and just have fun with the game. Lee's Lops, biggest fish is 125 pound tarpon. Right on. That's awesome. No feelings for anything I can ask for. <laughs> well, hey, ask for food. If you don't know what to ask for, ask for food. That's my rule. Ask for a special uh, type of candy or something that you don't get very often. Michelle Sanborn. How's it going, Michelle? Ah, oh, you get almost weighs as much as you. <laughs> really common dots to the point of almost being mistaken for sleeping when they get flipped upside down. Yeah, well, I have seen that. Yeah, a lot of fish are actually like that. You can, um, you can actually do something like that to trout as well. kind of go like in a catatonic state my mom doesn't want to fix it oh that stinks canter's out take care of canter 218 pound air pine no so much fun sounds fun 40 pound catfish right on michelle that's awesome Favorite YouTube, I watch you every day. Well, thanks, Xbox boy. George, appreciate it. Braden Thompson, remember you from yesterday. I don't remember you from yesterday. Uh, but your name sounds familiar. I don't do anything on Tuesday, so that, that I mean, it makes sense that I don't remember you from yesterday, but, but yeah, your name sounds familiar. At least it feels familiar to me. 
Bronson 07, what'd you miss? You missed uh you missed one one beluga. We got our hands on a beluga. Just sounds like an old car whenever I say it. Beluga. Like an old Packard or something. Need to get to a hundred likes. <laughs> That's a good goal. If we could reach a hundred likes, that would be great. Goodness gracious. I saw that one of our last live streams went to 100 likes and I was like, oh my gosh, that's insane. Where is the best place to go as a beginner? You know, Lone Star Lake is free. You catch some fish. Move, uh, if you want to catch a lot of fish that don't pay very much, uh, Rocky Lake is a great place to go. Uh, you catch a ton of trout, even if they don't pay very much. If you're wanting to catch fish out the Yahoo, Rocky Lake is a great place to go. Spinners and just catch trout head over heel. You learned a lot of me. We'll run on. One shot, one buck down is here. Ryder Horchek made his first hunter video. We'll run on. Nathan Ryan, hello. Hello. Yeah. I'm just messing with you, Brayden. I, I know. What's your biggest strip bass? Strip bass. Uh, I don't know. We'll have to look. So I can get bigger fish, but I don't know how to get fish that get a lot of money. Just Do I just keep going? You absolutely keep going, Max Gardner. Keep it going, man. But, you know, just, you know, always remember to have fun. You know, some some people, they get into this point when they're like, oh, I want to catch the biggest money fish in the game. Where's the biggest money fish? I want to catch the money fish and then I'll level up and then I'll move on to the next money fish. And it's like, well, then you're not playing the game. You're just trying to make money. That's not the game. That's your game. If your game is make money, then you're going to make money and you might not be having as much fun as if you were actually playing the game as it was intended. You know, there's an asp. Good 11 pound asp. Trophy, trophy asp. That's what I like to see. Beeping? You beeping over here? General Kenobi is here. My goodness gracious. Do you have the X-Series Newt? No, I don't. I have an X-Series Bass Jig, though. You're my inspiration for YouTube. Well, thanks, Ryder. Appreciate it. Tanner Canyon, long time no see. Can you play this in VR? I don't believe so. Are we just doing Fishing Planet or are we mixing it up? No, nope, we're just doing Fishing Planet. On Wednesdays. You got your Sunday right on. Who's my favorite YouTuber? Um, I'm a little biased because my my fiance or not my fiance, my wife, she'll only watch certain people. Uh, you know, and if we're eating uh, a quick dinner or something like that, we may watch a video of someone uh, just to do something for 15 minutes. And uh, we only watch PewDiePie, so. So PewDiePie is probably my my favorite stream uh, favorite YouTuber for that reason, but but I watch a few a few other people, not a whole lot. How much does a place cost where you're at? It's eleven thousand to come here and eight thousand for uh, advanced license, so about nineteen thousand altogether. Bo, I love your fishing place. Well, thanks, appreciate it, llama. Tanner Canyon says, what's up? I don't know if you'll believe this, but I'm playing Fishing Planet and doing a live stream. That's what's up, man. <laughs> Ooh, a bite. There we go. There we go. Emmett Cole's been trying to get on the live stream forever. We're right on. 
Max Gardner, thanks so much, bro. I love you in your stream. Max Gardner, thank you. Oh, first of all, I'm glad you're here, Max. I'm glad when you can make it. Ooh, this looks like a decent asp. This looks like a decent asp. Get in here, you asp. Oh, he's being stubborn. He's being stubborn. Unicorn, unicorn, unicorn. Get in here. I'm ready, I'm ready to hit the button. Unicorn! Let's go! Look at that, personal best as well. That is awesome. These these asps are really pretty, honestly. I like the I like the model for them a lot. That's an asp right there. Why can't I zoom in anymore, huh? It's I need to zoom in so much. Get one with the with the score in there. Good deal. Two thousand three hundred dollars. That's awesome. That's good. That's a good amount right there. Look at all this. Leave your memes on the Reddit, nineteen-year-olds, and I'll measure your bleep bleeps in the next episode of Lawai. My biggest fish, 50.999 pounds. The fish name is Butterfly Peacock Bass. No way. You liar. You liar. <laughs> a 50 a fifty pound peacock bass would be insane, though. Could you imagine? Are you taking it or are you just fooling with me? Fooling with me. <laughs> I'm going to go <laughs> Take care Ryder Have a good one man Have fun Hope we are reeling in too fast That ass though <laughs> That would be a good one That's a good one Megan Oh Oh Good night. What is your deal, sir? Sir? Calm down. This dude was just being a pain in the ass. Here we go. Thank you, Louise. Have you ever had a good luck on the Quattro Colinas? Yes, indeed. Not the luck that I want, though. I want to have the uh, Grand Slam kind of luck but un unfortunately it's only Diamond Red Deer Diamond Wolves Diamond Mouflon I got so many Diamond Mouflon Thomas Burris what did you miss? you missed uh, a Bluga a unique Asp a couple of different things and my dad saw it and he give it said no he said give it or no Xbox Jagged Dagger. It's a rough life, man. <laughs> oh, yeah, it was close. We almost had him. What's your biggest fish in real life? You know, here's the thing. I caught a big channel cat, right? I I caught a very big channel cat. And I'll I'll show you a picture. I'll show I'll show you a picture. Because here, here's the point. Here's the point I'm trying to make. How do I, how do I do this? Okay. Um, pictures, fishing photos. Okay. Look at this fish. It is a giant channel cat. Biggest channel cat I've ever caught in my life. In my life. This thing was massive. I could fit 
my entire hand in his mouth and he still had room on the sides. Like that's how big this channel cat's mouth was. And, and at the time, my dad was saying, oh, it's 14 pounds, it's 14 pounds. And I was like, I was kind of like, you know, okay, I'll go with it. 14 pounds, sounds fine. Here's the thing though, just the other day, uh, there was a guy on the fishing app who posted a channel cat, also 14 pounds, and he actually showed the scale with the fish on it. This was his 14 pound channel cat. Here. Now, now which one looks bigger? Mine or his? Huh? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. His is 14 pounds. Mine's bigger. That's all, that's all I'm saying. I didn't have a weight scale at the time, so I don't have any way to say. I didn't have a, a ruler with me to like measure him. I'm telling you though, big fish. It was a big fish. Anyway, I digress. I digress the color blue. Where is Zach? Zach is out doing some some stuff, I guess. I don't know. He was going out to get some dinner, I believe. So you like Flair? I don't like Flair. I like John B. I don't watch a lot of Flair. Your biggest catfish is an 80 pound flathead. My gosh, that is a big, that is a big catfish for sure. Relop, Pixar didn't happen, man. Pixar didn't happen. <laughs> right now, I'm thinking your biggest catfish was a tiny little baby channel cat because I don't have any pics, so I don't believe you. <laughs> I'm gonna start spreading that rumor. Lee, Lee, Lee Lop's biggest catfish is only this big. <laughs> the Kansas cat. The Kansas, one of the Kansas cats anyway. Just got the trophy lodge and it makes call out so much more fun. By the way, when you started, did you golds in the lodge? Did you put golds in the lodge? Uh, I did some, some that were big. And now I only do, I only do the, uh, the ones that are 95% or higher. It keeps me from, from putting a lot of smaller animals in my lodge and saves me a lot of money. Ethan Raver's back right on by pizza rolls, ice cream sandwiches and fishing tackle. Well, you, you can't buy AR 15s anymore. Actually, they, uh, they stopped selling guns in a lot of stores. But you can buy fishing tackle. No one gets mad at fishing tackle. <laughs> yeah, I read that, Thomas. How do you make the most money at Rocky Lake? Catch a lot of fish, man. There might be a, a minor difference between like rainbow trout and like cutthroats or something like that. But I would just catch fish. General Kenobi is here. I already said that. <laughs> you don't like you don't like Flair? I'm unsubscribed. Here's my thing with Flair. I feel like he does a lot of things for just the videos. Like he goes out and shoots something, goes out, does this, does that for the video. And and I'm not someone who, who just wants to go out like if there's a squirrel in my backyard I'm not going to to make a video saying oh catch and cook squirrel or, or shoot and cook kill and cook squirrel just just to make a video I'm not gonna kill something for a video that's what flair does like flair kills all sorts of stuff for videos otherwise he would probably never do it and that's that's where I draw the line 
if you're going to go out and shoot a doe or something for some meat uh, during deer season, that's cool. And you might film yourself while you're doing it. But don't go out there and make a video about shooting something that you wouldn't necessarily kill if you weren't going to make a video about it. It's kind of like when you give homeless people money. Like, you see all these videos of giving homeless people money. And you wonder, like, would they just give a homeless person money? Or do they have to film themselves doing it? And you just don't trust the person anymore? That's my thing with Flair. He makes a lot of random hunting videos like that. And it's like, what are you doing, dude? So, yeah. It's, uh, it's a lot deeper than you ever suspected, but that's my thing with flair that's why i don't like flair what is the best bait to us to get bigger i don't know man you're gonna have to let me know what you're fishing for i guess oh you're probably so cute he was tired. He was sleeping on the couch this morning. I haven't fished for carp successfully for years. Hey, man. Well, you've got a good start anyway. Six pound carp is still a fun cash. That's for sure. Bunch of people that want him to sub to someone called Bo. Ooh. <laughs> Unicorn trout two pounder. Really? Oh my god. Will you guys just take the bait? So much nibbling going on here. Oh yeah, the musky golem, if you catch him in a kayak, he's, he's, he is pretty easy to catch. I think he was one of our fastest catches. Greetings, Sir Sir Starkey. It is going well, Cole. Thanks, Sir Askin. How are you doing? Only one person got a fish. Is that right, G-Man? <laughs> That is crazy. What what place are we at? We're at Octuba. Octuba River, man. Hence the title. Octuba for YouTuba. I messed that up. I mean, he no messed that up. Come on, he nail, throw right. We got things to do. Okay, we're gonna we aren't catching any fish. So we're gonna reel these in and throw it back out. I must got his knife on Global Reward. Jeez. Hey, right on, Jack. That's awesome. Yeah, but if you're... Uh, I just don't think... I just... I don't like it. I don't like it. It's, it's more of just a personal thing, I guess. You're free to like Flair, of course. I do not, Llama. I do not. What is the best bait to catch? You just started playing the game. Uh, worms. Worms and dough balls. Try it out. You know, you can click on the fish. If you go to... I'll show you. I'll show you. If you go down to fish species or wherever you're fishing, you can just click on whatever fish you're fishing for and it'll show you their preferred baits. Medium cub bait, large cub bait, large minnow, crawfish, duck muscle meat, shiner. Try those out, you know. Uh, they're gonna be you know, biting on one of them. I remember that uh, when I was first fishing, I had uh, a large minnow on one rod and I had duck muscle meat on the other rod. Uh, I was only catching Will's catfish on the large minnows. On the duck muscle meat, I was catching Will's catfish, and I was catching uh, belugas. So it's like, it's like it kind of goes back and forth. Whatever fish or, or uh, whatever bait you're using, I guess. Bait casters are so much better. Here's the thing, and obviously part of it is. Uh, is uh, the type of rod that you get, but the the bait casting rods in this game aren't as long as the spinning rods in this game, and it's it's kind of meant in that way. The bait casting reels are are going to be stronger, I believe, and have more line, but the spinning reels, um, 
that you can throw them out further and you know it's it's kind of got its own balance and everything is kind of what I'm trying to say but you can use so for instance here we go trying to get nibbles out the yahoo here so that's a seven foot five and here's a seven foot ten we're going to right there and this should be pretty similar because it's only seven foot ten it's actually shorter and that might be because of the lure that we're using half ounce versus now they're both half ounce so actually i think that's actually too light yeah half ounce is too light so we're being that's a detriment there um but spinning rods are some of the farthest casting rods in the game so for instance if i were to pull out my carp rod i mean gosh dang it not what i wanted game uh. there we go pull down my carp rod I mean, I can cast way over there by those reeds if I wanted to. Just because it's just a... The, a lot of the spinning rods just have... They're longer. And so if you're using a spinning reel, you can usually cast out further. But if you're using a bait casting rod or something like that, uh, you, you'd benefit from using a boat or something like that where you can get out to where you want so that you don't have to cast as far. So uh, I guess that's kind of the biggest takeaway. If you're fishing from a bank and you need to reach out somewhere really far, uh, a spinning rod and reel combination would probably do you better than, uh, you know, a spinning rod and reel combination. <laughs> better for making money uh emerald lake is gonna be better is what everyone usually thinks because of the walleye you can catch lots of walleye you know jagged dagger it's just just up to you main See you later, Bronson. They like nibbling on it a lot. <laughs> the game tuber, how's it going? And Jay Z, Jay Z. Jay-Z, Jay-Z. Bryson LaFone. The fan. Avery Owl. Owl. Am I saying that right? How's it going, Avery? Oh, stay up. I wasn't paying attention and my lure went all the way to the bottom, basically. There we go. We got him. I think they are too, Austin. I think they're just smaller fish messing with it. Hey, we got a Xander. A trophy Xander. Right on. That's a change of pace, eh? $949 for seven pounds. Not bad at all. Tantan, how's it going, Tantan? Dylan Leclerc. There, he's taking it. No, you took it. I saw the line. The line was going. Don't lie to me. Mmm. The line was moving, I swear. I'm I'm frustrated now. <laughs> Ethan Ravers, how's my day been? My day's been great. 
it's actually been pretty stressful, but you know what? The things you don't finish today, you can finish tomorrow. Well, they took it out. Full 440 pound total fish at Lone Star at Lone Star. Oh my God. I don't think I would have enough time, honestly. I don't think I would have enough time to catch 440 fish, 440 pounds of fish at Lone Star. Even if I caught four pound fish, I'm not, I mean, what's the heaviest fish we could catch at Lone Star? Nice $724 for a Wells catfish there. Let's throw this back out. Man, just catch uh, spotted bass is the only thing I can think of, man. Are you an Eskimo bow? I hear it snowed in Kansas. It didn't snow where I'm at. It was nice out, man. It was like sunny and yeah, I bet it was like 50 degrees or something. Zero to bees have on YouTube on our profiles. We're right on, Llama. Appreciate it. David, how's your day going? Hey, there we go. We got him. Hook him. Tie lines. Tie lines. Little asp. Can he hear you, asp? There we go. There we go. Five pounder. Get wrecked, Tan Tan. Well, thanks, Jay-Z. Appreciate you being here. <sighs> hey, is the free version of this game worth the time and effort? Absolutely, heavens. It's a free game. It's got a ton of depth, and uh, everything you unlock in the game makes you feel really good about yourself. It's like uh, you work so hard in this game that when you buy a rod and reel, you feel like you worked for a rod and reel in real life. And so like all of my equipment that I have, I'm just like, I'm attached to it. I'm like, this is my best rod. This is my second best rod and I love them. They're like my family. How's everyone doing? Hey, we're doing great. How are you doing? It's supposed to be in the twenties tonight. My goodness gracious. And because I feel so bad about watching your videos makes me want to buy a capable PC and play it. Hey, we're right on. You know, I bought my I, I I bought all the parts and built my PC to play the Hunter Classic. I know I've said that, and for, to people who watch me a lot, you know that's probably getting re really repetitive. But yeah, <laughs> so I totally understand building a computer, buying a computer to play a specific game, because that's what I did. Love your Halloween monster videos. Well, thanks, Joel. I had fun making him. Zachary and I both had fun making him. Is a 13 pound mad eye. Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> right for real, you come out. All this asp conversation reminds me he's still there. <laughs> Better go get him, Squish. Go get him. 54 degrees in Texas right now. Oh, I got you. You look like a true TikToker. Oh, how did you know that we're starting on TikTok? I'm kidding. Hudson Waverka. Hello, hello, hello. That's disgusting. How's your puppy? Mine just ran away. No, why is your puppy ran away? Why did it run away, Jagged Dagger? Game Tuber, love your vids. Hey, thank you. Jack is back. Jack is back. Back again. Jack is back. Tell a friend. Bye everyone. Jack, I never leave. Oh, well, that's nice. Build a piece here. What parts are good though? It's not it's not me. It's not me. Hey, I didn't either until I really wanted a good PC. And then I learned. Check out uh Linus Tech Tips or uh Bit Bit I'm um, Bitwit. There we go. I was blanking. Bitwit and Linus Tech Tips. Learn everything you need need to know about building a computer. 
It's really easy. There's only like, uh, two, three, four, five, six, six main parts. Monitor seven, keyboard eight, mouse nine. So nine main parts. <laughs> Get those parts and you're ready to ready to go. Lots of beeping, and now no beeping. I'm telling you. Hey, there we go. Ooh, that's a good sized fish there. doesn't look as big now that I have it closer to me. When I jumped that first time though, it looked pretty decent. I think we got a trophy asp. Yeah, a trophy asp. 10 pounder, thousand dollars. Hey, I wish you guys would like stop playing around and actually take it. Do you think that's a possibility? Got that fresh cut, looking good. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> you you noticed hmm the snow was melting off the roof my goodness that sounds so hot lost your shed to snow every year my goodness what's your favorite fish to catch oh I enjoy uh, the difficulty of carp fishing but I also like what the heck was that about I also like catching pike I think pike fishing is fun it's just it's just constant they're so voracious bye g-men Thanks, Tan Tan. What setup should you use for the bass at Everglades? Well, it depends. You can kind of have two different bass setups. You can have one to target uh, the butterfly peacock, and then you can have one to target the butter, uh, the largemouth bass. Not butterfly bass. Goodness gracious. So uh, you can have, oh, uh, a nine pound rod and reel setup to go after uh, peacock bass. And then I would make sure that you have uh, if, if you're putting on larger hooks, I would make sure you have a, a 12 pound setup for the largemouth bass. Even if you have a smaller hook on there, it's, it's quite possible that you catch a 10 pound bass that could end up just taking you all the way out and breaking your line. What are the lights in the background? My, my my lamp is like freaking out right now. I tried to slow it down so that it, it would change between green and red slower, but I can't figure it out, so. It's just doing its own thing back there. Hello there, General. No snow in London, no. Hey, that's a fish. That's a fish. Gosh dang it. Why can't we get a big fish, huh? Why can't we get a big fish? Bleach blonde gelled spikes. Ooh. Ooh. I remember those days. Old school Chester Bennington. Now, I don't know who Chester Bennington is. But I can picture it, David. I can.
The 1.265 pound 13 inch channel cap. Well, right on, Llama, you got one. You as well, Xbox George. Thank you so much. The Twitch says where you can keep the stream up and look through different apps. That would be cool. I feel like, uh, my, my, uh, yeah, I feel like mine does that, though. So I, I don't know why you can't do it. Why do people want Canadian snow? Because it's got maple syrup in it. Yum, yum. Oh, there's my rod. I was like, where is that thing? Ooh, ice cold Canadian water. Now we're talking. Cat Gamer. How's it going, Cat Gamer? If I ever mentioned snow in London, it's supposed to snow in England on Friday, so it's like, I've always never seen snow. Ooh. That'd be cool. General Kenobi. You gotta say something more than hello there. I've already said hello to you like three or four times, man. <laughs> Whoa, who, who is Chester Bennett? Is this gonna be a face that I recognize if I look it up? Is he like some drummer for some band I don't know about? Okay. See, but the, the pictures of him here are just all like real short hair so see he just has he just has a buzz cut just a little buzz cut so i don't know lincoln park was the first band you saw in concert my goodness gracious i don't know names either So we had a uh, nibble there. He was the man. Yeah, I remember that. I was in college. Harrison's gonna be right back. Blake Thomas, how's it going? does not care about hockey don't care what you say i don't care about hockey <laughs> what are you used to catch the bait the fish on the bait caster what am i using what do you what do you mean max gardner like the rod and reel combination or what who's that pokemon it's a snorzax 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 can you do another monster video? No, unfortunately. They're all I've caught them all. I can't do anymore. There are there are none more. There are none more. Pikachu. Hello, Blake. When I found out they sent me home, I cried so hard I threw up. Oh my god. That's sad. <laughs> Pours his maple syrup on the snow and then heats it up only a bit and then it becomes maple taffy and she gives it to him. What? That's a thing, Llama64. What? You like my new lights? Oh, thank you. Well, thanks, Blake. Appreciate it. Although we're running out of good time to be fishing here. I think we're going to reel in and change the time. <laughs> what did we catch? We caught a unique asp. We caught a big old beluga. We caught a bunch of wells. A couple of xander. Trying to go for the big fish, though. Give me that big fish. Uh, let's change the time to... I forgot that they now tell us what the fishing is like now. 
What do we got? We got a half hour left. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, that's pretty good. We'll do that. Shall we move on down to the bridge? We can go try the bridge now. I'm, I'm open for that. I was over here for a little bit. I never caught too many. You're in boss. You're in boss. We are. Okay, I was wondering. <laughs> I put out a marker over there to uh, show what the deepest spart. Deepest spart. The deepest spart of the river. The deepest spot of the river uh, was. It's right here. I originally was thinking that a good place to throw out would be that uh, that pylon over there. Because, you know, big fish, if there's a current and everything, like, behind this big ol', uh, you know, support beam here, would be a good spot for them to kind of get out of the current, and they could wait for fish there. But I wasn't catching any fish right there either, so, I don't know. All right, those are out. We'll wait now and cast out with this bad boy. See if we can pull any out of here. Bruce Morris isn't doing good tonight. Well, what's wrong, Bruce? I'm Rambo. LOL, go by the bridge. We we already are at the bridge, Rambo. Silly goober. Terry Price has been watching since 1K. My goodness. Well, Terry, thank you so much. Appreciate it. The true fan. The true fan. How old am I? I am 26, about to be 27. If you extend the stream, we'll donate $60. I don't want you to donate $60, Llama. It's fine. But I, I better go spend some time with the missus. She's worked all day long and she finally got home at like 6.45 and then I was off to do a stream, so I haven't seen her for very much. Got to have a balance of, of uh, life and play and work and all that, you know? It's healthy. Got to stay healthy. He's 56. I am 56. Got ya. One of those got ya moments that you didn't know. I'm 56 years old. Or Kip in four hours. Good luck, Bo. Enjoy your night. Hey, thank you so much, Jack. Take care and have fun. Take care. Have fun in class. That's what I meant to say. Yeah, I know, Austin. I'm just messing with you. Hey, he's got a big fish. The pike? What is that thing? It is a pike. We got lots of nibbles. La 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 llama. Thanks, Blake. There we go. There we go. That's a decent sized wells. Trophy probably. Yeah, 32 pound trophy wells. That's awesome. Is 
take it. Take it. I know you want it. Grind is a pain in the button. Use large cub bait. Yeah? We could try large cub bait. Will do. The first time a YouTube said your name. Aww. Well, Blake, I'm glad you're here making everything fun let's keep up the good work Hudson thank you so much we'll try to anyway goodness gracious getting busier by the day <laughs> busy busy there we go we'll throw on some large cut bait we'll try that try that for you Rambo lol The stream title is gold. Thank you. I was like rhyming. I love rhyming. <laughs> I had to do it. Once I thought of it, I, I actually had something typed out like we're going after a huge fish or something like that. And then I like came up with that while I was writing the description. I was like, ah, oh, that's way better. So I changed the title. Oh, I'm I'm already happy, Austin. It's fine. Does anyone remember Beyblades? I remember Beyblades. Look at that going. It did go for that uh, cut bait there. Does seem a little bit bigger. Ooh, did we uh, did we get another? It is another sturgeon. Look at that. Beluga sturgeon. Ooh. Jagged Dagger! Thank you so much! Appreciate it greatly. Let's get this guy in real quick. He's uh he's struggling too. Honestly, if this is a big wells catfish. If it's not, I would much rather catch a big, uh, big Wells catfish right now than a uh, beluga. This is gonna end up being a small beluga, I'm telling you. I'm like sprinting to keep keep up with it. Come here, you. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get in, get in. Trying to do a yank and crank here. He's just pulling us out. Ah, it's another sturgeon. Frickin' frack. Bjorn boss, take the other rod. <laughs> Bjorn boss, what are you doing? I need your help. Gosh dang it, they're both, they're both belugas. That one was at 20. He was so close to getting in. We could have just caught one. This one's bigger than that other one though. Are you gonna be on Twitch tomorrow? That's the idea, Terry. That is the idea for sure.
Dang, I really wanted this one to be a Wells Catfish. Enil is definitely struggling. Golly, man. Bad thing is I can't tell which one's bigger, so I don't know which one to focus on. This is the one that we almost had at 20 feet. We're literally like three feet away from getting it in. Come on, there we go. Remember the uh, the alligator gar? Remember that? That was fun. This is what that reminds me of. Battling two really heavy fish at the same time. Over stupid cards. Well, evidently you just didn't have the heart of the cards. It's funny. My brother like started watching Yu-Gi-Oh again the other day. I got through the first season and because uh, it reminded me of my childhood. Hilarious. Eli Grosso, how's it going, Eli? Sorry, I'm trying to. I'm, I'm like I'm trying to read the chat and at the same time trying to reel in these fish. Hopefully they're getting tuckered out by now. Where are we at? We're at Octuba. You know, if you guys ever want a quick answer uh, without chancing it that I see your comment, you can always check the video title or the description usually. Usually I say something about it. I don't just leave you guys hanging. <laughs> 80 now, 79. 73. not working come on man we got him we got him take him and sprint sprint he now sprint God is 106 pounds. <laughs> Sprint, he nil. Run, he nil. We gotta get the other rod. <laughs> get it. We got it. There we go. Two sturgeon. Two belugas. Oh my God. Oh. I just felt like one of them was gonna get off at any moment. Firewolf Gaming is here. How's it going, Firewolf? Rowan Williams, love the vids. When's the next in real life fishing? Man, as soon as I can catch some fish, bro. I tried the other day. I was fly fishing for bluegill. I couldn't catch any, though. I might have to try somewhere else, maybe. There we go. 60. 60 now. Terry's got to go to bed. Hey, take care, Terry. The Yu-Gi-Oh! show was good. The card game, not so much. Yeah, I kind of like just collecting the cards from the, the show. Like, oh, I saw this one in the show. I want it. <laughs> I didn't actually like playing the game, though. Who voiced Ash from the original Pokemon? That, that is really cool, David. Uh, I remember the, uh, the Comic-Con. There was a Comic-Con coming to uh, Kansas City. And um, 
Adam Savage from Mythbusters was there, and uh, the voice of Mario. I can't I can't remember his name at the moment, but he was going to be there, and I had uh, a ticket to go see both of them, uh, to have like a five minute chat with both of them and have like a picture and everything. I was really looking forward to it. Ooh, look at that. That's a fish and a half right there, 114 pounds. That is sweet. 2,500 XP again. Boy, we're close to leveling up, everyone. $4,000, $4,000. You know, Eli Grosso, I honestly don't. Uh, my my go-to is just to say, watch my beginner series video and do what I did. Uh, I, I honestly haven't learned anything since then. 91 likes at the moment. Hey, right on. It's R1P, but you changed your name. Ah, oh, I gotcha. You changed your name. Man. Can't believe you. Why would you change your name? So we got him on the duck muscle meat and the large cut bait. But uh, thanks for being here and saying hi, man. Appreciate it. Catching with Colton. Hello, hello. Oh yeah, that's absolutely true, Harrison. I, I still don't know how to play the card game. But we all played the heck out of the video game. Man, I still... I... How like... I bought the uh, Nintendo Switch. It wasn't the new one. It was like the Let's Go Pikachu version of the... Of the gold... Yellow? Pokemon Yellow or Gold or something like that? Pokemon Yellow, I think. I don't... It, it's... It was different. But anyway, I played it on the Nintendo Switch. I had a great time. Uh, the video game. It was great. <laughs> Anything where streamers can play with you? Uh, yeah. I mean, I got... There's Bjorn Boss right here. They're playing with me already, man. How good are my rods? They're, they're decent. I mean, they're pretty standard for someone in the high 40s. Mid to high 40s, I guess. Rohan! Rohan is here. What is up? I am playing Fishing Planet. I'm trying to keep it on the DL though, don't tell anyone. And why have you not friended me on the Switch? <laughs> I tell you what, I don't even remember last time I was on it. Anytime I'm usually on it, it's like we have a bunch of people at here and we're wanting to play Mario Kart or Mario Party or something like that. It's usually like the last time. Last time I played. Understandable, Nathaniel Cop. Nolan's here. How's it going, Nolan? Uh, you just have to friend me, Rowan. You have to friend me on Fishing Planet and join into the game. Pretty simple. Just try to ch just try to type it out all in one line next time. That way you don't spam the chat with three different messages. Not a big deal. Three more minutes. What? We got 12 minutes, man. Firewolf Gaming's birthday. Ooh. Well, happy birthday, Firewolf Gaming. Hope you're having a good one. Come on, where are you? I played the big boy card game. I haven't been playing for years, and now I got an overpowered deck. Well, right on. That's awesome. I don't know how to play that game either. <laughs> Connor, how's it going, Connor? The game Tooper. Well, I tell you what, we are not catching anything on this right now. Maybe we should mix it up, throw on a different lure. Ugh. Getting some nibbles. Uh, 
I do not know that, Andrew Scott. If I did, I would be rich. <laughs> Absolutely, gaming. Joshua Holmes, how's it going? Carson Peters is late, but he's here. Hey, right on. And he's going hunting over the weekend. Right on. Mario Kart tournament in class? That's sweet. Ooh. Gosh dang it. Nice Cold War gaming section. It's about to be lit. Right on. That's awesome. There we go. We got a fish. What do we got? Like a European perch or something? Another little Xander. Right on. Can you go for Wells Catfish sometime? You know, I am going for Wells Catfish right now. It's just that I keep catching uh, the belugas. Hey, train. Toot toot. Bye, train. In fact, I'm just going to reel this in. We're going to go back to the dock spot. We changed the time to evening and then we moved over here. I'm going to change the time back to nighttime and then we're going to go back to the dock. Back to the dock, bro. Bro, back to the dock. <laughs> but you're interested. I understand. Getting notifications from YouTube. Janelle! No! No notifications? That's the worst. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna change the time to... Oh, crap. We have to wait five minutes. Are you cereal? Are you super cereal right now? Okay. Megan, take care. You're hype. Good. You should be hype. And uh, and David's going to bed as well. We'll take care, David. Have a good one, man. Hope you do as well. Hope you have a great day. Oh no. For your birthday, Firewolf Gaming. Hopefully. That was some good beeps. You should continue doing that. That would be great. Well, that's cool, Carson Peters. Are you super cereal? You taking it? Can't tell if you're taking it. The rod's not bending. Maybe it's just a small fish. Oh, now that one's going. Hope you guys like the sound of beeping. Beeping is great. I love sound of beeping. I'm just gonna get this and I'm just gonna don't go down oh it's it's holding on now I like to uh, just get them out of the rod holder just to uh, just to make the game know that I, I I'm interested in reeling them in <laughs> I'm, I'm very paranoid about that. I always feel like if I don't even attempt to reel them in, the game will think that I don't, that I'm not interested and will let them go faster. 32 pound trophy wells catfish, very nice. Yeah, that's a good fish. Jingle with me, baby. 
That's a good fish. <laughs> Gonna surface? Interesting. Hey, that's a that's a that's a beluga. A beluga. I'm back and I'm happy, but at the same time, I'm going to miss the feeling of my hair. Aww. Just like your alarm clock. Oh my gosh. I like him too, but I can't I can't get a big one on my line. I'm having difficulty. Every time I try to catch one, I end up catching a beluga. Like right now. Ryder is back, right on. Ryder is back for the last four minutes. Might take us four minutes to get this guy in here. Bo, what's your name on Fishing Planet? Llama64, I'll give you I'll give you three guesses. And if you don't guess it, then you're out of luck, man. <laughs> Ooh! That's a beluga boy. Ooga boy. And she is not an easy game. It's a hard game. And there was nothing in the cabinet. Sad day, Nolan. That that's it, Llama 64. You got it. You nailed it on your first try. <laughs> That's Zach's name. You for you're forgetting Tantan. <laughs> what pound line are we using? Uh, on this rod, I think we're using 44 pound. On the other one, I don't remember. 52 maybe. Try to tune into every stream? Well, thanks, Ryder. Appreciate it. Do, 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 do. Ah. Well, that's all gone. You know what that means. Almost the end of the stream. Ah, it's a beluga. Booga. Booga luga. They're so funny. He doesn't seem that big. cool what level are we Dallas I think uh, 47 maybe maybe 48 I can't remember look at there that's a big face 103 pounder not too shabby well everyone 
Good night. That's fish right there. Fish and a half. 78 inger. Not too shabby. Next Wednesday, we'll have a... Uh, We'll have uh, a new video showing off October River. Have my, uh, you know, my BZ Hub beginner series in October, so you can you can check out that video. It'll be pretty great. I'm pretty excited about it. Had some good stuff in there for sure. Um, and yeah, I mean these sturgeon are amazing. These belugas, big old belugas. But uh, yeah, I'm glad everyone was here. This was a lot of fun, everyone. Um, like I said in the very beginning, all of this music here is uh, lo-fi, hip-hop, Christmas music. It's my favorite type of genre, a music genre anyway. It's just so so chill, so relaxing, got a good beat to it. It's what I listen to when I am studying or working or reading or something like that. So uh, got a whole 45-minute long The Hunter-themed uh, Christmas video holiday season video you can check out with uh, all this stuff so that's gonna be good uh, another note next Monday is my birthday and so instead of a nighttime stream we're most likely going to do a daytime stream uh, probably around noon so uh, noon central US time so 12 o'clock central US time um, that's just so that I have the evening to go do family stuff and whatnot for my for my day of birth you know so so yeah so look forward to that an early an early stream uh on monday unfortunately for some of you so yours is the fourth you'll be in school then well maybe we'll make it three or something like that three to five maybe we'll do three to five how about that we'll make it we'll make it three to five uh, PM Central. I'll put out an announcement for it, but yeah, it'll be fun. I think it'll be great. So anyway, you'll still be off on Monday. Ooh, right on. Are you streaming tomorrow? That's the plan. Streaming tomorrow on Twitch, 7.30 to 9.30 PM Central Time on Twitch. We'll see you there. Uh, if you're still here and you haven't hit that like button, please do so. It's free. It helps me out. It's great, and I uh, really appreciate you all being here. But take care, everyone. Have fun. Have a good holiday season. And as always, remember, everyone, we're one planet, one family.